Hey, orange one here. We, um, in the last episode, got just got back to the base, and from what I remember, yeah, Tuner was out here somewhere, and he needs to come back home. And then Nikon was like going to go meet up with Tuner, I believe. Yeah. And then these guys in the heft, they couldn't do their work. So what we can do is we can maybe assign them to work a mine or something. Their mine. What's that? No. What's that? Small copper resource. Yeah, go for that. Or no, that only can have one person. Um, is there any other mining mining uh, things around here? No. There's no one over there. I'd rather keep the two of you together, though. We'll have you guys go out there. And what I was thinking was Orange One could probably knock out a bounty. We're smart about this. And everyone else will keep here. So Orange One, sorry about your arm, but we need you to get a bounty for us. So why don't we have you go to... Stout, because that's going to be the closest place that we can get a bounty from. And we'll see where that takes us. I might make a cut here. If there's anything interesting, I'll show it to you, though. So I was just minding my own business, and it looks like our whole village is getting attacked by sand skimmers. I don't think we can take them, so we're going to rush everyone indoors. Yeah, there's no way we can take that many sand skimmers. Sorry. Garu, I think, might die here. I'm not sure. Everyone, I want you holding your position in there. No. You guys do not go out there right now, please. Uh, close this and lock this, and then hopefully the Garu doesn't die from this. They might. It's not looking good. Might be able to run the sand skimmers off with the Garu, I'm not sure. I don't think the Garu can actually lose a limb. I'm not sure about that though, though. Um, everyone else. You can come out now. But hopefully you're doing first aid, not just running around. That was bad. We gotta be careful about those skimmers. They could totally take this camp out if we're not careful. Luckily we've got an indoor area, though, so I think we're fine. I think those skimmers are going to leave us, leave the Garu alone. Okay, I think we managed to survive that. Yeah, looks like the Garu's going to be fine. Oh, we got more. <laughs> What's with them coming through here all of a sudden? Get indoors and shut that door. <laughs> They weren't doing this just like a little bit ago. Is it just me or does that Garu heal crazy fast? And let's keep an eye out for bounties for Orange. Because this is around the area that we'll actually start seeing some bounties and yeah, looks like we got some people up there. That's promising. What do we have here? Oh. Who are they? We're going a little bit slow. Let's speed this up just a little bit. Mercenaries. Samurai. Okay. Not much luck. Let's see what else you can spot around here, Orange One. 
Maybe you go towards here. What what do we have here? It's a pretty big group, so I don't know if we're gonna be able to knock them all out. I've also got a feeling that we'll be able to get a bounty from them. Oh look at all those Garu right there. Slavers. We could follow the Garu maybe and see if they get in combat with something. It's an option. Oh, can I see the moons? I wanted to see if I could show you the moons. Yeah, I don't see. I don't think we can see the moons right now. Oh. Yeah, there they are. You can see there's kind of two moons right there. Um, Orange, we need to get a bounty. And everyone else... Are you guys back out now? Okay. You're doing your own thing. Okay. Let's pause for a minute. Garu, why don't you come back to camp? And... It looks like they're back. Okay, you can... Actually, you know what, Nikon, why don't you mine the iron resource? And then we'll be able to get more iron. Uh, Moo, why don't you sleep? And it looks like everyone else is working, right? Okay, that's looking good. Uh, orange one, can you get us a bounty, please? Ooh, what do we have here? Outlaws, they may have a bounty on them. Let's just check. We got super lucky uh, a little while back. Yeah, but these guys don't have any bounties on them. Bummer. Part of me was just knock them out and take their swords and stuff. We're going to keep on looking though. Why don't we go over here towards this giant squid thing? We got a couple groups now. What's that? It's a different group of outlaws, I believe. Oh look, there's there's one bounty worth a thousand, which is not an awful lot, but I think we'll go for that. Unless this other group up here has a better bounty. They're vagrants, so it's unlikely. Um, yeah, orange. Why don't you stalk these guys? And then, actually, let's check up on you guys. Got some copper, at least. We'll stock these guys. Um, then maybe with that copper we'll have enough cash to do some stuff. These guys are fighting the skimmer. Do they have bounties on them? They do. And looks like they just knocked out the skimmer, so... Or no. Probably be able to get that 1,000 bounty off of these guys. I'll let them take out the skimmer first. Or maybe not take out the skimmer. Maybe we'll hang back. Yeah, it looks like that skimmer is going to kill them. We'll just hang back and we'll get that guy. Actually, can we sneak up while they're fighting this? That skimmer. That guy looks like he's about to go down. Orange one, why don't you see if you can grab this swordsman? Yes. Start running towards stout. I think we're clear of the skimmer. Is this guy going to die before we get to stout? I don't think he is. I mean, he's definitely taking a, taking a pretty bad hit there, but I think he'll make it. I don't think he's going to get to the, what is it, negative 100? I think that's when you die. Oh my god, those skimmers that just went down into that sand. I don't know if you saw that, but 
There's some skimmers right there. They're a little sneaky. Okay, with that 1,000 bounty and the copper, we should be able to, I think, afford the uh, the plates that we were trying to get. I'm a little bit worried about hunger, though, because our main camp's getting a little hungry. We could try hunting. I think that's probably going to be our best source of food with that camp. I think this was the police station, right? The orange one in there. How's your... Yeah. He should make it. Not by much, but he should make it. Orange one, sell that bounty to him. There we go. It's a pretty good bounty. Alright, guys, let's go ahead and get you back indoors. We'll get you the supplies that you need, Skinner, to work, and um, some more plates as well. Get you both in here, and then Ridley, why don't you go to. This is the one that has the plates, right? And they also have some leather. Okay, you're moving real slow. <laughs> Actually, Skinner, can you get that meat off of that skimmer? I'll take all of that, actually. We'll sell all that stuff. Orange, why don't you go ahead and look for another bounty? That was pretty good profit that we got from that. That scrounging that we did. Go back towards that squid thing. We got some pretty good results from there. Yeah, you guys are going hungry. I think we might want to go hunt down a skimmer. We can find uh, one skimmer by itself. That might be a good idea. Actually, who are these people right here? Can we take them? Cloud ninjas. They've got some pretty nasty stats. They have. Oh, they're black desert ninjas, but they're cloud ninjas. That's weird. Um, they don't have any bounties on them, so we don't want to fight them. Any skimmers that we can see there by themselves? No. We might need to have Orange One bring back some food. Let's stop speeding things along. What do we have here? Orange One, go, go over there. Some vagrants, it looks like. Too far away to really see them. While he's doing that, are you guys... Yeah, you guys are back here. Um, Ridley, no. Why don't you guys stop doing the copper resource? At least Ridley, because you're so slow. Why don't you come up here, Ridley? We'll come back to you, orange one. Let's check these guys out. Any bounties? No. Yeah, that's not worth getting in combat then. Or even trying to assassinate. So let's run over here. Yeah, I was hoping that we could hunt a skimmer, but I don't think that's going to be a good idea. Especially seeing how most people are kind of injured. Else, what are you doing? You need to be sleeping. You're really badly beat up. Actually, Jewel, why don't you go ahead and 
and heal up as well a little bit. At least we're not like getting hurt from breathing. That is a win, I'd say. God, Ridley, you move so slow with your prosthetic and your backpack. Yeah, sell the copper, sell the armor. And buy the leather. And then... I think we also need a few of these. I think we need four of them. Okay. Skinner, did you get more copper? Yeah, you did. Let's have you come back, because you're going to want to sell some stuff. What about Orange One? Is he ready to get another bounty? Oop, we got some people walking up on Orange One, actually. Where are you? Bounty hunters? Okay, well, we definitely want to stay away from you. You're not going to have any bounties on you. <laughs> oh, skimmers. Actually, maybe we could run those skimmers into them, and then we could take their items? Pretty mean thing to do. Oh, that skimmer went down pretty quickly. Orange one, why don't you go ahead and take the, the meat from there? Then you could bring some of that raw meat back to our camp. But I don't think that that's going to go over too well with people. <laughs> I think we should get another bounty, I think, with Orange One before we go back. What about you guys? How are you doing over here? Yeah, you're working on that. Skinner, why don't you go ahead and sell that junk that you've got there? Let's talk to you. You guys aren't going to eat um, the raw meat, so we'll sell that. Or the foul meat you won't eat. No, I want you over here. Ridley, put those items in there. So Skinner's got that to work on. And oh, why are you? Who are you? A sand ninja. Oh man, they're gonna destroy us. We get in combat with them. We've got a huge bounty though. Could maybe run them into the like, sand skimmers or something. Oh god, they're so fast. Drop the backpack. It's the only way you're getting out of this. Make a run for the gate. We'll have to come back for our backpack. That sand ninja's fast. How fast are you? Twenty-one. Well, we go twenty-nine, so we're okay. I think with our backpack we were too slow. I would really like that bounty though. Maybe the guards will kill him? I think that it's a UC bounty, so I think the guards will kill him if he gets too close. And then we can uh, actually heal him up and take his bounty. Yeah, it sounds like a good plan to me. There's no way we could uh, take them on ourselves, but... These samurai have uh, similar stats to him. There we go. We'll turn him in and get our backpack. Yeah, orange one, why don't you go ahead first, see what items he has on him. Oh! <laughs> Look at those katanas! They're so good! These other items are like meh. Okay. 
Let's pick him up, turn in that bounty. That's gonna that'll be pretty good set. We'll be pretty well set after that. Um, and then we'll get our backpack and maybe make our way towards camp again. Yeah, I think that's probably a good goal. We do need our backpack, which is out that way somewhere. Oh, we got out of that pit of uh, owing all that money. Nice. Now, where was our backpack? It's out here somewhere. seeing the backpack. I'd like to not lose that. I might have to look at the video and see where exactly it was that we dropped it. I'm pretty sure items stay on the ground, so it should be around here somewhere. I guess they're manhunters. What am I doing there? Got the camera controls with the mouse, which I don't like. Where did we put our backpack? Oh, there we go. That was around here somewhere. Okay. Let's go back. I think we'll actually keep the katanas. We'll give those to maybe Tuner and Moo. That orange one, let's hurry up a little bit more. I was thinking about attacking those guards and then just leading them to the, the guards, but that just feels a little too cheap. Um, where's that guy that sells the animals? I'm pretty sure you're going to have food in here. Yeah. Go in here. The good news is that our base is going to be pretty nicely set up. Oh, actually, we can start doing some science research. What is it that I wanted to do next? Um, I'm not sure what I wanted to do next. I think we wanted to do some training dummies, didn't we? It'd be kind of nice to do some thievery training, because on orange one we can get working on that. I think simple training dummies is probably a good goal for now, because then we can get a couple people doing that at our base. one what were you doing again yeah you're in here right okay we we're gonna go get some food for our camp and I think we're gonna keep those swords yeah Let's have you maybe go by the bakery or something. Because we've got the cash, you might as well get like proper food for people. Is 
Is there a bakery in here? I don't see one. Oh, there it is. It's just right next door. Orange one, why don't you go get food for people? And then we'll make our run back to our little uh, city. Our desert city. Oh, I've got the perfect name for it as well. I need to figure out how to name them. Um, let's get... We'll just get chew sticks. I know it's not the most filling, but it's better than nothing. And orange one, let's have you on back. So before... Let's see, how do I... How do I name my own base? I know there's a way to do it. Now stay here. Not our squad, is it? Yeah, I'm not seeing a way to do that. I'll I'll look it up in next episode. We'll we'll name something after it. Oh, actually, we we're gonna get some proper beds. Uh, We'll do that next time. We'll get. We need to get food back to our base. People are getting hungry. Oh, is this full? Um, let's get some storage then. Storage for. No, we don't have storage for that. Um. We are going to get a little cactus thing going, so let's get some cactus storage there. Wait, you got building materials right there. And what other things could we build? Because we've got plates as well as storage um, or building materials. We could get a little research bench going up here, but I don't think it's really worth it. Um, yeah, I don't think that there's much that we can build that's going to be worth it. Orange one's running back. People in the heft are working hard, I think. Yeah, getting research and armor crafted. I'm gonna see how long I've recorded for. I think that this is a good amount of time for an episode. I might make a cut here when Orange One gets back and take care of like one or two more things and then we'll end the episode. Alright, so Orange One just got back and people just immediately ate the food that he had um, and I think we should be able to build a cactus farm I think we've got enough uh, cacti here yep we do and let's do it as close as possible right there that looks good to me uh, it says we need 10 cacti don't we have 10 we got 18 well why don't you take the cacti <laughs> and make the farm then? So now we've got a beginnings of some food that we can grow here. Which is kind of weird because we are in the Deadlands. What is that in the distance? Is that why I, th I think it is? Oh my god, it's the Holy Nation. What's the Holy Nation doing all the way over here? That's not good. <laughs> um, anyways, we've got a little farm. I also built a few storage containers. We got some research done um, at the other base for those. So we actually, um, yeah, we have something in which we can store things in. There we go, that's all taken care of. And then why is, 
Why are we not mining right now? Els is, is down there. Let's have a spade do that. So we need water, which I don't think we have a way of getting water here because a well is... Actually, we could build a well. It's just very little water that we're going to get from it. Well, we need some water, so we're going to do that. Um, Namtran, what are you doing right now? Oh, we've got traders coming our way. That's great. Um, spade. Can you help build that well, please? No. Namtran, I think we're going to have to get the building materials on you, and you're going to have to build the well. And actually, you've got some cacti on you as well, so we can actually upgrade this, I believe. Yeah, we've got enough to upgrade that. Let's get you doing the water first, and then we'll upgrade that. Or not. I guess you're going to do that other thing first. Well, we've got some food, we've got some water. We've got a house, we've got some beds. We've got the beginnings of a little settlement here. And we've dug ourselves out of that money pit. So we're doing okay, actually. You guys are a little hungry, though. It's starting to affect your productivity. Where is Skinner? You're in here. It's a shame we can't get more leather easily from these stores. Um, we're going to want some more books, though. We're going to do some more research. At the very least. Not sure what we should research next. Probably chew sticks, that's probably the best for us for now. Um, might want to make uh, our own weapons. That might be a good idea. <laughs> We're going to need a lot of ancient sci science book if we want to get to the next tech level. Uh, I think hemp based fabrics because we should be able to get hemp and grow it in the arid uh, climate which would allow us to get some cloth which is always good because then we can make medical supplies and other things from that so we'll do that. And I think we're outside of United Cities control. I could be wrong about that. Where's Namtran? I thought you had cacti. Why don't you help out with that? How much does this need? Needs two more building materials. Namtran, you have the building materials, so why don't you work on that? Things are looking good. I think in the next episode I'll name this little settlement, but I think I'm going to end this here. Actually, hold on. Why are these not built? Nope. Build. So that you can train. Why don't you help out with that? Yeah, but he's got the materials for us. Get that built up. And... This as well. I'm just going to finish these constructions in this episode. So I don't have to worry about in the next one. There we go. And then who's going to get water for us? 200, why don't you go get the water? Just for now, so that we can get this started. 
It's gonna take forever though, <laughs> because we're only getting 10% of the maximum capacity. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.